This being the last night for Rush, it's the end of an era for us, but it's the start of something even better. Particularly in the restaurant business in Calgary, if you're not evolving, you're gonna get left behind. The last night was great. Everybody was pretty excited about it. We just wanted to go out on a high note, which we did New Year's Eve. I don't feel like it was the saying goodbye, though, to the Rush 1.0. It was just uh, moving on to the Rush 2.0. Our last day was New Year's Eve. If you're asking how we're starting the new year, yeah, it's, it's ripping the place. We've got demolition going. This is more about a retooling. This is more about staying relevant, staying ahead. It's still Rush. It's the all new version of Rush though. So there'll be a lot that people will be able to recognize about the previous Rush, that love the about Rush. And it's not like they're gonna come in here and go, wait a second, what happened? They're gonna go, wow, this is great. You guys have done the room justice. It's very exciting. It's like having a kid. I'm nervous. I'm excited. I can't wait for what the future holds. And it's a big investment in a lot of ways, both physically, emotionally, huge investment. We really kind of had that aha moment of Bull Brash Evolved. That's where everything goes back to. That bar is all three of those. It's bold. I mean, you can't deny that. Uh, it's brash. We're not trying to be subtle with it, but it's evolved. It's sophisticated. It's slick. It's clean. It's a cool looking bar. We've had this private space since we opened. It was always a part of the brand. We actually were able to double the capacity of our private dining spaces. So we now have the ability to host groups of 50 or more. We've got a larger private room that can seat 20 in a boardroom setting, a smaller private room that can seat 6 to 12. So there's no restaurant in Calgary that has private dining space that is this accommodating. If you're looking to dress or impress, if you're looking to enjoy, if you're looking to treat yourself, or if you're looking for a burger and a beer, there is a lot that we can offer. It's not just a place for special occasions anymore. From the ground up, it was built first and foremost from a customer perspective. You know, we spent a lot of time thinking about how the spaces will work for individual customers to tables of four to groups of 400. Ocean Prime is seafood and beef and it's the modern contemporary modern cuisine steakhouse. That Ocean Prime we feel like kind of resonates with that premium level, that high-end brand that we strive to be with Rush. It's completely changed but still sticking to its roots like using modern techniques to cook but still making it like a steakhouse. The Carpaccio, it's a huge platter, same with the seafood tower, no one's doing a seafood tower like that. Those are some of our signature dishes that we want to show off. The rush bacon, for example, right? Nobody has the balls in Calgary just to serve a big slab of bacon on a plate, right? And we do. And that's what people love about us. Big, bold, brash. That's what it is. <laughs> we sit down with our customers and ask them what they want. And what they're looking for is more substantial portions, more comfort style food. This wine cellar has been here since we opened the doors. We've had this gorgeous custom built wine cellar. It looks great, it's a display cellar, but it's also practical. It's where we actually store our inventory of wine, our libraries of wine. People weren't really seeing it and appreciating that now you get this great vantage point from just about anywhere in the restaurant or lounge that you can see this best in class wine cellar. It's gonna make a big splash um, and it's gonna be here for a long time. We didn't build this to be a hot spot for six months. We built this to be a landmark restaurant for the next 20 years.